If you notice when you take a look around and you stuff with uh, into the grounds of the UN and uh, you kind of you will see a lot of information of sculptures and stuff that identifies uh, the world and sometimes how it's broken, how it can be fixed. It identifies a lot of the cultures throughout the world and out there and now we're going to be going in uh, the chief of the Anadaga is going to be doing the opening and it's such an honor because it took us a long time to get to where we're at. Uh, it took many of our elders and stuff to help pave this path so our voices can be heard for these, uh, these uh, two weeks of sessions that are going in. So we come here with uh, announcements, uh, we come here to hear our voices be heard, uh, we come here to bring solutions. We just stand within the unity and of the oneness, so it's an honor to be here because I'm one of the four grandmothers of women of O'Briety. And saying this, we have a strong voice for the women for the missing and murdered women. We have a strong voice for a lot of the women that are sitting in the prison sleeping that they're being forgotten. We have a strong voice for the women that are across the globe in Africa, uh, third world countries, even in the free world and stuff that don't have a voice within their own community. So we stand for you. You're not being forgotten. We don't stand and speak for you. We just speak for recognition for hopefully someday that you'll be able to come here to have your own voice be heard, your story, your testimony, because we need to validate. Because without us, there's not going to be no more human beings because we are the birth givers. That was, that was our right. So I want to welcome you all. We are on the grounds here, so, uh, so it begins. So. Look forward to the next one where you'll see the posts and stuff. Also keep in mind too, when we come here, we come here as volunteers. We do all our own fundraising and out there. And as everybody knows, New York is not, a, it's not inexpensive. And we try to stay at the most uh, places that are convenient near. We, we're staying at a backpacker's lodge or a YMCA at Vanderbilt, so it's inexpensive. Uh, we don't need to have plush, we just need to have safety of a bed. Uh, our food we share within amongst one another. Uh, we picnic, we do whatever it is, but we don't come here for uh, uh, and a luxurious journey. We come here to do work, so we just want to keep uh, keep that in mind. So we welcome you, and we hope you get somewhat uh, of an eye opening of what's happening here at the UN during the Indigenous session. Chinigos, thank you.